Detective Ike Carter here, Savannah Victims Unit. Detective Irvin Carter, ditto. Hey, you in the back! Yeah, you in the back! And maybe you in the front! We just got an alert over the radio that someone was still talking. We play it by the book. And always follow the rules. So let's all quiet down and start paying attention. The show is about to start. Good morning, Southminster BBSers, or should I say, Jumbo. Jumbo. Welcome back for day five of our Savannah adventure called can y'all give me a good four this morning? Oh my gosh, you sound great. You sound great this morning. I am so happy to see you all back here for day five. Our very last day here together at BBS. Oh, that makes me feel sad. But we know that when life is sad, today we're actually going to learn about how to praise God even when good things happen in our life. But today we are going to learn that when God is good, when life is good, God is good. There we go. I got it. I got it out. It took a second there, but I got it. All right. Do we have any birthdays that we need to celebrate today? Dun dun. Elle, is it your birthday? It's, a, it's your grandma's birthday in four more days. Well, happy birthday to your grandma in four more days. Jameson? It's almost my birthday. What day is your birthday, Jameson? December 22nd. Uh, almost. Hang in there, buddy. Hang in there. It's almost his birthday. Yes? It's almost your birthday? When's your birthday? August 18th. Closer. Yes, Noah. No, we're going to hear everybody's birthday. Catherine Vandertye, when is your birthday? Tomorrow, but she's not going to be here. Catherine, come on up here. This is so exciting. We finally have an excellent, 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 excellent excuse. And we are going to sing to Miss Catherine. We're going to sing happy birthday. One, two, three. Adventurers. Yesterday, what happened? They're, they discovered that their whole Savannah Animal Reserve got washed away by the flash flood, and they were sad, weren't they? They were sad. I remember. Let's check in with our safari adventurers and find out how they're doing today. Well, uh, first of all, the artifact went missing. 
Uh, then two of our team members got accused and then arrested by frankly inept local cops. Uh, then everyone had to evacuate the campsite and even stuff. And then the whole valley got washed away by a flood, destroying the nature preserve. Yeah, that's right. It's really, really unfortunate. It, it really is. I wonder how the ratings are doing, though. Yeah. Yeah, it's, yeah no, I'm not about that. I'm, I'm just saying this stuff's going to make for great TV. called <laughs> savannas <laughs> throughout a few of the countries in Africa. Of course, when you see me, the first thing you notice is my spots. Those spots are spectacular and special. You all have fingerprints that are unique to just you. Well, no two giraffes have the same spots. They also keep us hidden a little bit. 
You may think we have a hard time hiding. I mean, we kind of stick out. <laughs> but since we hang out under the trees, our spots help us blend in with the dappled shade under the tree. We love leaves. They're my favorite snack. And since giraffes are the tallest animals on the planet, it's a breeze to just reach up and grab a bite. Even though we can grow to be as tall as about three adult humans, we're really not that different from you. We have the same number of vertebrae, or neck bones, that you do. Seven. Ours are just a tad bit bigger. You know, my height gives me a chance to see a long ways, both looking ahead and looking behind. When you look ahead, or remember things that happened a while ago, can you see God's goodness? Do you remember to look back and thank God for all the good things He's done? Do you see all the good things God has given you? Things like health, a family, friends, and a new life in Jesus? Everything good comes from God, because God is good. The Bible tells us to remember the Lord who is great and glorious. Take time to remember all the good things God has done. Because when life is good, God is good. So you see, we can have faith that God is good when life is unfair. Or scary. Or changes. Or sad. Or is good all the time, no matter what. God, God is good. And um, some of you may know, um, Mr. Dave has been taking some videos, not just the videos you made, but videos of the skits, and they are uploaded to YouTube, right? Right? And the channel is, is it Southminster? Southminster Presbyterian. Southminster Presbyterian? If you search for Southminster Carl. Search for Southminster Carl, you know, Pastor Carl's name, or Chief Ishmael, as I like to call him. All right. Thank you, friends. It is time for us to do our very last love offering. So I'm going to bring out our special buckets. Group A, today is the day for you to donate whatever you have available. Group A, come on up. And I will put this down here, and you guys can come on up and make your special offering. It's scouting location. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on a second. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna add one more sound effect. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Group A. Do you need any help? Do you need some help, Pumpkin? Are you got it. Thank you so much, Cruise 1 and 2. That was so wonderful. How about our Cruise 3 and 4, Group B? Group B, can you come on up, Cruise 3 and 4? If anybody has any donations today, bring it on up. Here comes Ripley. Here comes Emmett. Ripley, here we go. Thank you, Evan. Excellent. All right. Very, very good. Group C, which I believe is six and seven, right? Orange shirts. Six and seven. Come on up, Group C. Nice to see you, Calvin. Hi, Lily. A bunch of money. Gabe is donating money. Does anyone remember what this money is going to be used for? 
What is this money going to be used for? Lindbergh lights the way. Lindbergh lights the way. Lindbergh lights the way. Which is a special helping group for kids and families in the Lindbergh School District who need help, who need some help either with buying school supplies, having enough food for their lunches. Group D, this is uh, five and eight, right? Five and eight. My blue-shirted friends, come on up, group D. My blue-shirted friends. You have a whole bed. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Ruth D. Dylan, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This song is called Arky Arky. And this song is about Noah and the flood and the ark and the animals, right? Because that was a time when it seemed like things were going to be very bad. It seemed like things were going to be very bad, but it actually turned out pretty good. So, this song has a really repetitive song structure. You sing one line, you sing it over, you sing um, a second line, and then you sing Children of the Lord. And then the chorus goes like this. You'll, you'll sing, rise and shine, give God the glory, glory, rise. Okay, and it tells the story of Noah's Ark. So the words are going to be up here, and I'm going to say it's okay for you guys to remain seated, all right, while we're doing the verses. But when we get to that chorus, when it says rise and shine, I expect to see some rising and some shining. So I'm going to expect you guys to be standing up on these choruses, okay? Okay. Um, the Lord said to Noah, they built him arky, arky. Lord said to Noah, to build him an arky, arky. Build it out of gopher, barky, barky children of the Lord. Get ready to rise. So rise.
really great. All right. We have one more day of our friendly competition. One more day of our special friendly competition about which side of the church you can see it louder. Will it be the east side? Will it be the west side? Will it be the side? Which side? We'll sing it better. What do you think, Mr. Tom? Which side do you think we'll sing it louder? The piano's on the west side. That's all he's saying. All right. This side is going to be the Alleluia's. This side is going to be the Praise You the Lord. Here we go. some great crafts. It's going to be so much fun. But like we do every morning when we get together, what do we do before we all go out to our different stages? We pray. That's right. So show me how you hold your hands when we pray. All right. Now it's important when we pray to give thanks because when life is good, that's right. We always have to remember to give thanks to God for all the good things. So let's pray this morning. Okay, repeat after me. Dear God, Dear God thank you for today. Thank you for today. Thank you for new friends. Thank you for new friends. And thank you for old friends. Thank you for old friends. Thank you for our families. Thank you for our families. And thank you for today. Thank you for today. And the fun we are going to have. Keep us safe and help us have a great day. In Jesus' name we pray. And then all God's people said together, Amen. You all did such a great job. You're great at praying. All right, now I want you all to look to your crew leaders. They're going to be the ones to lead you off to your stations this morning, all right? We'll see you all back here at the end of the day.